Dear friends in Christ Jesus, We live in a world which had become obsessed with fame, recognition, worldly riches, prestige, power, Facebook likes, Instagram followers, and Twitter responses. Well, these are not completely wrong. But if they lead us to pride, then we need to check that. The Gospel of the day warns us against looking for celebrity, titles, status, and publicity. There is even a temptation to want even our virtues to be publicly known and admired, or to use one's wealth or status to become the privileged guest of honor. Jesus is kind enough to understand this common weakness of even good people. So he advises them to sit in the lowest place. The story in the gospel ends with the most difficult guideline of all, being humble. Saint Augustine said in one of his letters, the way to Christ is first through humility, second through humility, and third through humility. He also said it was pride that changed the angels into devils, and it is humility that makes men as angels. Dear friends, the Lord is not asking us to put ourselves inferior to anyone, but He shows us the right Christian attitude, humility. Humility is as St. Thomas Aquinas says, seeing ourselves as God sees us, knowing that every good that we have comes from God as pure gift. Dear friends, when we see ourselves honestly, then there is no place for pride. A truly humble person will always look up to the approval that comes from God alone. He is committed to service than status. He keeps in his mind his own limitations and places the God-given gifts at the disposal of others. Dear friends, the greatest teacher of humility is our Lord Jesus Christ himself. St. Paul in the letter to the Philippians says, Jesus Christ humbled himself and became obedient to death, even death let us learn from our master for he says learn from me for I am meek and humble of heart Amen